Hello, I'm Associate Professor Toby Bell and I'm a teaching and research academic in the School of Chemistry here at Monash University. In this video, I'm going to talk a bit about why chemistry is a great choice to study and how it is going to be central to our efforts in meeting the big global challenges that we are currently facing. And then I'll tell you about some of the benefits of studying chemistry here at Monash and how to enrol in our first year chemistry units. Chemistry is known as the central science, and you can see this in the way it overlaps and intersects with other sciences, from physics, materials and the earth sciences on one end, and with biology, medicine, pharmacy and health applications on the other. Chemistry really does underpin and support a wide range of scientific disciplines and applications. And as I mentioned, chemistry is going to be critical in addressing the global challenges confronting us. Here's a selection of such challenges that you are probably aware of and passionate about making a contribution to. You can see that chemistry is vitally important in dealing with these. For example, the molecule shown here is remdesivir and was the first antiviral to be FDA approved for treatment against COVID. New materials for energy applications are going to be required as well as ways of sustainably securing food supply. All of these will require chemistry and align with Monash's Impact 2030 vision of mitigating climate change, promoting geopolitical security and fostering thriving communities. Importantly, studying chemistry provides an assured future with excellent employment prospects, not just because of the deep chemistry discipline knowledge and expertise that you will gain, but also the range of generic or so-called soft skills that are highly sought after by employers and are specifically developed and worked on during our chemistry courses. Here I've put together a list of jobs and careers that you could go into by studying chemistry. And again, it's not just the chemical knowledge and bench skills that are useful here, but the wider skill set that you will obtain by studying chemistry. And this list is not exhaustive. I'm sure you can think of more. You might also like to know that Monash's Bachelor of Science with honours majoring in chemistry is accredited by the Royal Society of Chemistry in the UK. This long established professional society undertakes accreditation of degrees worldwide and Monash is the only Australian university whose chemistry degree has received their tick of approval. So you can be assured of receiving the best and most comprehensive chemical and scientific training when you study with us. I'll now talk briefly about the units we offer in chemistry and what you can enrol in for first year. At first year, we offer regular chemistry and advanced chemistry, both are broad-based general chemistry courses comprising one unit in each semester. Regular chemistry is Chem 1011 and Chem 1022, while advanced is 1051 and 1052. It is worth noting that there are no prerequisites for enrolling in our regular chemistry units, so it doesn't matter if you haven't done chemistry at high school. You can enrol in Chem 1011 and 1022. If you have taken Year 12 chemistry, for example, VCE units three and four and done well, we recommend that you take the advanced chemistry option. The main difference in the advanced course is that you will spend more time in the lab, at the bench and on the instruments doing chemistry. Another point to make is that these units can be taken in either order, giving you flexibility and the possibility of starting straight away with chemistry if you start your degree mid-year. Once you have completed two first year units, you can enrol in our range of second and third year units. Units such as synthetic chemistry, physical and analytical chemistry, materials chemistry, med chem, even food chem. We also offer research project units where you are embedded in one of our active research groups and undertake your own project for a semester and receive course credit for this. Projects are offered at both second year and third year. The units here are CHEM 2990 and 3990. Also worth noting, if research is something that you would like to do, is that you can take a research project on exchange at one of our partner universities in the unit CHEM 3980 and receive course credit for that. A major in chemistry requires eight units, typically at first year two, and then two or three at second year, and then three or four at third year. 
There is room for electives and a minor and even a second major in another discipline if you wish. If chemistry is your thing, then you can take a double major in chemistry. As I discussed at the start, chemistry really underpins a range of other scientific disciplines and taking some chemistry units alongside a non-chemistry major is really beneficial. In fact, you can get a minor in chemistry with just four units of chemistry. So if you do first year chem, you are already halfway there. For more information regarding us and the School of Chemistry at Monash and what we do, have a look at our website. And for enrolment information, go to Monash Connect or inquire at ask.monash. Looking forward to seeing you in chemistry.